Good morning, my friends. Well, today is Monday. Today is my last day, and then I'm off for a day. I have to let you know, yesterday, this nice lady brought in this beautiful bird. It was a cockatoo. I took a nice couple of pictures. Go make them under color by numbers. And then, you know, this morning I get up, I'm like, okay, what are we going to do it on? And I thought about it, and it was my mother, because the animals, my mother loved animals. We went to Florida once, and honestly, a parrot landed on her in the show. And the guy goes, this never happens. My father's like, she loves animals, they're a trap. So it took her like five minutes to get it off, but that was the highlight of the show and my mother. <laughs> then, I was thinking, me and my nephew Jim, we were little. We, oh, we, my mom found the animal, a little bird that was attacked. So I put it in the shoebox and she explained to me and Jim that it was a little too far gone. So we said a little prayer. Then we kind of like had to bury it. We buried it outside. Then we also, that another year, we got turtles from Florida. We named them. We had them for about a week and then my mother's like, my father's name was Jim. She goes, Jim, something's the matter with the turtle. She goes, oh, no. How are you going to tell Susie and Jimmy that the animal died? She goes, well, it's part of life. We're just going to have to explain that the poor thing couldn't get used to the water difference from it was used to different water than we had up here. So they took us in the bathroom. And then they explained to me and Jimmy how the turtle went to turtle heaven. And that God and Jesus were taking care of them. Then we flushed it down the toilet. <laughs> but that's how she explained to us about that. And it was a good way when we were only like six and eight because we still didn't know much. But I thought I'd let you know. I love you, my friends. Auntie Sue.